28-year-old Leroy Hercules of Dorban Street, Georgetown and Aichuni Region 10 was a serving member of the Ghana Defense Force for the past nine years. At the time of the accident, at around 19.30 hours on Monday, he was driving a motorcycle and crashed into a 29-year-old Plum Park resident when he attempted to swerve from a load of sand on the road. Both Hercules and the resident were picked up by public-spirited persons and taken to the Georgetown Public Hospital, where Hercules was pronounced dead while the resident was admitted. One of Hercules' nieces, Angelica Duke, told the newsroom that he suffered a broken neck and internal injuries. She said he was not wearing a helmet at the time of the accident, and so she believes he would still be alive today if he was wearing one. He never liked helmet. He, I mean, he's supposed to. I don't know what's it with these young people these times. I mean, they always say, oh, I'm a bad man and I stay some. Me wearing no helmet, me frighten police. But for me, helmet is protection. So whoever is out there is listening. Helmet is not for you to show off. Helmet is for protection. Maybe if he had wearing helmet, I think in more cases than one, at least a six to four to chance, he probably would have lived. Duke said the family remains in shock as they describe him as the baby of the family. He was the youngest of 12 siblings. But one thing for sure, he always get me to do anything for him because I love him that much. He was that dear to me. So hearing of the accident, I could not have believed until I see him for myself. Yes, I had to get some support from family because it was heart rendering. Everybody is in mourn and shock. Because he's a guy, he always with a lot of luck. So having a dead news was, was shocking and unbelievable. Hercules' fiance, Tamika Edmondson, who is also the mother of his two-month-old baby, was too distraught to speak with the media. Hercules also leaves to mourn a four-year-old daughter. A post-mortem examination is expected to be done on Wednesday. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Isinala Pato. Back to you, Avinash.